guys, it's Tiffany Riley, and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing this really beautiful, glamorous look for New Year's. 2022 is just around the corner, you guys. I honestly cannot believe it that we are almost done with 2021. It seems like it just started, to be honest. So, to help you guys ring in the new year and to help you kind of get pumped up for the new year, this, I created this look just for you guys. And hopefully, it, it's, it's very neutral, but it's also glamorous at the same time. So, let's get started. So first of all, of course, if you have long hair, you might want to pull it back if that's easier for you. And of course, if you have bangs, kind of just do them to the side or you can do it like up like in a headband or whatever. So the first thing we're going to be taking is, of course, primer. I am using Rare Beauty's Illuminating Primer. You guys can see it. And I'm taking about one pump of that. And applying that all over my face with clean fingers. Under my eyes, all over my eyes. Just make sure that it gets everywhere. If you need to, you can use a little bit more, but a little goes a very much so long way. you want to, you can get your neck as well. Alright, the next thing we're going to be taking is foundation. This, I am taking the Rare Beauty Liquid Luminous Foundation in the shade 150C. And I'm going to be using the dot method. I recently trimmed my bangs, so hopefully this will be a little bit easier. Let me just do a little bit of foundation off the corner on my eye. Now I'm going to do in kind of like a swiping circular motion. And then this foundation may be too dark for me. What in the world? This is probably my lightest, the lightest foundation that I even have. How light is my skin anyway? Maybe it's just the lighting of me and me. And of course, if you have any left over, you can put that on your eyes as well. But I'm going to be taking foundation. Normally, normally take, normally I would take like an eye primer. But I don't have any at the moment, so we're just going to, so I shout out just, foundation works just as well. Alright, next we are going to be taking the Tim Burton the Nightmare Before Christmas Love Never Dies palette. So this is what we're going to be using. And we are the first shade we're going to be taking. We're going to be taking a fluffy brush, and we are going to be taking the shade Love Never Dies. It's kind of like the shimmery bronze color, and we're going to be applying that on our crease. In my opinion, this is an extremely pretty color and a very neutral color for New Year's, for ringing in the New Year. And it's very pigmented, I might add. Okay, we're going to be taking a little brush, what is this, an eyeshadow brush? An eye crease brush. 
and we are going to be taking we are going to be taking the shade Halloween Town. And we are going to be placing that on our lid. And we're going to try and blend those two colors together. For a nice, colorful, shimmery look. Now to give kind of like our inner corner some shine, we are going to be taking the shade of Bone Daddy. And we only want just a little bit. So kind of just tap it. Just like so. And of course if you want to, we can But just a little bit. Underneath the eye, just like so. Hmm. Now for eyeshadow. Thought I had it with me. I mean eyeshadow. For eyeliner, we are going to be taking I'm going to be taking the Mega Effects Liquid Liner Eyeliner from Avon. I'm going to try my best to make not really the best. I don't really like these markers, honestly. I did. I thought I had another eyeliner in here that was better, but I don't think I do. No, I do not. Okay. I thought I did. Oh well, I thought I did. Um, and now we're gonna be take. Now we're gonna be taking the the this mascara in, from Rare Beauty in the shade black. This is their miniature version. This is their miniature version, which in my opinion is the cheapest. Next we are going to be taking blush. I'm taking the Melting Blush from Rare Beauty in the shade Near Nearly Berry. And then I'm going to be taking a brush, just a small brush. Oh, I just kind of I know I have it. Just a brush like this, kind of like a fluffy brush, and just... Like so now for the lips we kind of we don't really because this is a new year's look we want it to be more of a i guess a glitz and glam look so we don't want to go too crazy with the with the dark colors so i'm going to be taking the matte liquid lipstick i believe in from rare beauty in the shade ascend this is a really pretty color
and just kind of clean up the edges just a little bit. Of course, I'm a perfectionist, so I have to do it. And then once you're all done with that, go ahead and take um, a setting spray. I'm using the 2-in-1, always in the 4-in-1. Yeah, 4-in-1, always in Optimus setting spray, also from Rare Beauty. And just... Give that a sec to dry. Take your hair down. Put on your favorite outfit. Take your hair down, put on your favorite outfit, and you are good to go. This is the uh, this is the uh, New Year's. Um, so you got you guys are ready to ring in 2022 with this amazing, glamorous New Year's look. Um, I will probably do. I hopefully this. Yeah, this will be my last video for 2021. I cannot believe it's almost 2022 already. So. Whew, let's see what is planned for 2022. So I hope to make more videos in 2022 and more, meaning more vlogs, more hauls, more everything once this pandemic ends, I ho hopefully. So be on the lookout for more vlogs, more hauls, every single, every single thing like that. I will try and do my best to upload every week, if not twice a week. I hope you guys are having an amazing day and night wherever you are. I really do hope that 2021 was um, all right with you, even though we were still dealing with COVID. And I, and I wish you guys all the best in 2022. And I will see you guys in 2022. I love you guys. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.